Guard your tongues. There's nothing more destructive for Muslim women than the tongue. The Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, he said to a group of men and women, if you guarantee me two things, I will guarantee you paradise. He said, the tongue and the private parts. And one time when the Messenger of Allah Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam was passing through his masjid and there was a group of women sitting there, he said, oh women, Allah Subhanahu Wa Ta'ala allowed me to look into the hellfire. And I saw that most of its inhabitants, many of its inhabitants, there was women. And those women asked him, how come you said that? He said, because many of them, they, they, they gossip and they talk too much. And they are ungrateful to their husbands. So that when their husband gives them something and spent all, everything on them, they say, oh, shukran, jazakallah khairan. But when they are angry with him, they say, oh, you never did nothing for me. And they are also given to gossip, tail bearing, using the telephone. You know, telephone, tell a woman. There's two ways of communication. Telephone and tell a lady. Why? Because you have more time. You're more provocative. The men, they do the same thing but in different ways. But because when you do it, it is more dangerous because you stand between the men and the children. Guard your tongues. The Prophet Sallallahu said, let him who believes in Allah in the last day either say what's good or keep quiet. So when you see sisters talking foolishness, say, sister, listen, if you don't have nothing good to say, my suggestion for you is, Uskut. Keep quiet. This is what the Prophet said, don't be angry with me.